All right, I want to try something a little different with this video. So most of the time with my vlogs, I'm making time capsules for my future self to look back on. And right now, my channel is experiencing a very interesting amount of growth. Today is March 25th, 2024, and my plan is to not upload this video probably until like the end of the summer. So what you're watching right now is a time capsule from over five months ago. In the last few days, I had videos do really well. If you look at the subscriber graph, I pretty much doubled my subscribers in a matter of like a week. That's the last year of my channel. And to give you more perspective, here's the lifetime graph. This last week is a very significant bump in that timeline. Okay, so where am I going with this? The point of my long form videos is to record every day of my life and share some of my moments and reflections with you guys. I told myself that this was gonna be the year that I hit 100,000 subscribers. So I'm pretty much filming this right now and I'm gonna post it in five months. And I wanna ask myself, if I'm not at 100,000 subscribers, what happened? Because I think something in my head really clicked. I've been saying year after year that I'm gonna hit 100,000 subscribers. When the world shut down in 2020, I said, this is it, I'm gonna get it in these couple months, I just need to focus. And then I said, okay, I'm gonna try to do it before I go to college. I graduated from high school. I said, maybe when I get to college. I'm now in my junior year of college and graduating in less than a year. Well about a year. And I made this video here talking about how I never wanted YouTube to be my job. If it's side money, I'll love that. The short form videos helps bring in a little bit of revenue. And my long form videos like this allow me to have a creative outlet where I can share stories. But money aside, I've always wanted to hit 100,000 subscribers. And because I'm doing live streams right now and I'm uploading a lot of YouTube shorts, I have a lot of confidence that this goal is actually going to happen this year. I'm filming this on day 1,545 of filming every day of my life. And this video should be going live August 2nd, 2024, day 1,675 of filming every day of my life. If you look at photos of yourself that are three or four years old, it's hard to say that that's the same person that you are now. I turned 21 in a month, and by the time this video is uploaded, I will be 21. And at that point, my fifth annual birthday video will be uploaded. But weirdly enough, turning 21 feels like a bigger milestone milestone than turning 20. And sure, that might just be because I live in the US, but things are changing very fast. And by the time this video is uploaded, I will no longer be living in this room and I will be completely moved out of where I'm living right now. By the time it's uploading, I'll actually be moving into my apartment for my senior year of college. I'm not entirely sure what I was going for with this format, but I just wanted to film a mini time capsule for later this year. So to whoever's watching this in the future, take it easy.